Okay, we're gonna fix up this total value here so it's actually accurate. This will be done with a total price computed property inside our checkout view. They'll calculate the value of their tip out of the total for the order and return that amount as a formatted string. So over here in checkout view, add a new property called total price. And it'll be a string that's computed. First things first, let's get the total value of the order as a double so we can calculate the tip percentage accurately. I'll say double order.total. And now our tip value is that total of the order divided by 100 multiplied by the double of the tip amount value they chose. So 15% means total divided by 100 times 15. And finally, I'm going to return the total plus the tip value using formatted as a currency with a code of US dollars like that. So send me back a formatted value as US dollars for the total value of their order, including tip. Now, remember, SwiftUI will re-invoke this body property whenever any of our at state properties change. As a result, we can use this new computed property inside the body and have it automatically change as any one of our segmented control value changes. So we can say down here, I wanna say section total, not 100, but just string interpolation, total price like that. And if you do that now, you should find it all calculates correctly and stays as a price with uh, cents and similar. So I'll say, let's add a full English, and then I'll add a uh, stack of pancakes like that. Then go to the order screen and choose place order. And you see it's 23 bucks right now. If I try a larger tip, 24 bucks, 25 bucks, or 22 bucks like that. It adapts correctly based on what I've added here.